Sasa G, hope you guys are all doing super well. It is Thursday, June 28th, 2018, I think. But today we are back with another pizza video because guess what? There's another goddamn trend. I swear to God. All I gotta say is prepare to be blown away. And quick message to my ASMR community. I know you guys miss me. I'm back. And today, I promise some ASMR for you. Oh my God, my lips are dry. Yeah. If you miss seeing this cute Asian face, yo, I upload every single day on my Instagram and my Snapchat. So follow me on both of those platforms. It's at David Parody for both. If you're not following me on there, honestly, we can't be friends. If this is the only dose of David Parody you get on YouTube. You're old. I'm a way more complex and one well-rounded human being than just YouTube, okay? I like to expand my big dick in different areas and Instagram and Snapchat is is two places I like to do it. Do so. I also can't speak English. Just take it easy. By the way, new merch is on the way. I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek, but I'm only gonna leave it on for half a second, so you're gonna have to be amazing with your paw skills. Ready? One, two, three, boom! Did you see it? That could be merch, so let me know if you guys want me to drop that. Never dropped something like that before. It's combining two things, my love for sriracha and the, the one thing I say at the starting of every single video. Today we are gonna be doing the glitter pizza that is taking over the world. And by taking over the world, I mean, I think it's just New York City, but it's like a big craze. Everyone's lining up for this type of pizza and we don't have it in Canada, so today, your boy is gonna make it. I have a lot of energy today. The first time I saw this glitter pizza, it doesn't look insanely appetizing. It's not something like if I went to New York City, I'm like, yo, this is one thing I need to do. I need to go get the glitter pizza. We're not doing anything else until I get it. It's more of like a, if we stumble upon the store, then maybe I'll consider getting it. And if there's no lineup, then I'm definitely not getting it. Like, it's just me. You guys can decide if it looks appetizing because this is a DIY. I'm trying to make it here at home. This is what I got. I went to Little Caesars right here. I got a hot and ready. Usually I get a pepperoni, but for the sake of the glitter pizza, I got just the cheese. So let's see how it looks. Can we just have a, a moment of silence for Little Caesars? Bro. This is $5. Actually, they changed the price. It's now $5.99, you goddamn scumbags. But look at it. It looks delicious. And now I have to ruin it by adding a bunch of glitter that I got right here. This is a full bag of glitter. I got red glitter, which was 25% off. I have pink. Now for purple, they didn't have the glitter, so I had to go with Pop Rocks, or in this case, Power Poppers. And then we got yellow, uh, green, and blue. So hopefully using these glitters, I can turn this normal cheese pizza that looks like a 10 out of 10 and I just wanna eat it right now into a rainbow DIY glitter pizza. But the problem I saw when I first saw this glitter pizza is it wasn't bright. It's not like inviting you to munch on it. It would kinda look like a little moldy to be honest. That sounds disgusting, but that's how I saw it. So I got another cheese pizza. Let me just see how good this one looks. And I'm just gonna try to make my own rainbow pizza with vibrant colors that just pop out you and just make you want to eat it. And I'm taking it very seriously. I'm not adding just like a bunch of random stuff that no one would want to eat. These are legitimate pizza toppings. And by the way, I'm insanely confused when people say Ryan Sways is a snack because I'm a cutie patootie. First steps first is I have no idea the pattern of rainbow, so I search it up. You got red first, and then you got orange, but I don't really have orange, so it's gonna skip to yellow. After yellow, we got green, perfect. And then blue, purple, and we'll do pink last. So we got our nice cheese pizza here. I'm gonna start off with the red sprinkles. Let me just start at the edge of the cheese here and then go around. Oh my God, so much is coming out at once. Yeah, oh shit, yo, is this edible? This feels like paper. No, no, and I'm blowing it when I'm talking. I might be off, I need to read the, the wrapper, hold on. It says it is edible, but guys, I'm not even kidding with you. It literally feels like um, like plastic. Yo, shout outs to the show Art Attack, one of my favorite shows growing up. I think that if I didn't watch that show, I would not be able to do this. 
Look how pretty this looks. I don't care what anyone says. I am not the. Somehow we gotta make it all the way to the middle of the pizza with the six colors too. I'm going for a second line right now. We need to thicken up the red. Use the cardboard as a nice little pivot. Makes it a lot easier. That looks like a good layer, bro. We're off to a great start, bro. I thought this was gonna look dookie. My glitter pizza might look better than the one in New York City. I'm not even kidding with you. I think their glitter is like kind of fused in with the pizza and it's not just lying on the top like this, but as you know, pizza that needs toppings. All right, next one we are doing is the yellow, sealed for my protection. Now, I don't know what the flavor of these are. Let me just taste it real quick. Try to turn it up to you guys. Ew. It tastes like nothing. It kind of just melts in my mouth. No flavor at all, so really, you're still eating a cheese pizza with a bunch of little pieces of plastic dissolving in your mouth. Good to know! Boom. I know I should have enough glitter to go around like three times, so I don't need to take it that easy. Oh my god! This is looking good, bro! The thumbnail is gonna look amazing, too! Oh, yes! Yes, yes, yes! Let's go for another round. Yellow looks so nice and pretty. Let's move on to the next color. I think that's good. I'm so impressed with myself. What's the next color I need? Shit, I need to open up the picture again. Next up, we got green. Oh my god, look at the glitter. Okay, that shines. Oh man, it's like soaking up the pizza oils too. I wish it was a little bit more vibrant of a green. That looks not bad, not bad. This is definitely what they use in New York because I can tell like the oils of the cheeses is like making it look like it's fused into the cheese. If you look closely. We got three more colors. Okay, I'm gonna take it easy on the green. That's looking naughty. Next up, we got blue. Oh my god, it looks so good. Let's go. Would you guys eat this? Comment down below if you would eat a slice because I'm about to try one. Let's go for one more round. Good. Okay, this is the only part where I cut corners a little bit. They didn't have purple at all, bro, so I gotta put some candy on this pizza. So I'm gonna take a bite. It's gonna be a little bit of sweetness, too. I am so stressed. It's not even purple. It's more pinkish. Oh, no, no, no. This one's hard to put down. Damn it. I should have went thicker with the blue, maybe. Okay, thank God we have enough Pop Rocks. And then to finish it, we got the pink glitter right here. Yo, Perodians. Tell me this actually doesn't look pretty cool. Ooh, you got yourself a rainbow pizza, baby. Oh my god, ASMR viewers, listen closely. You can hear the pop rocks. That's so cool. Moment of truth, guys. Let me try a slice of this pizza. Oh my god, look at the colors, bro. That's oh my god, I need a thumbnail. Okay, that's why they don't just put it on the top. The red just fell into the yellow. I'm stressed. It's just a cheese pizza with, with pop rocks and dust and plastic. ASMR, ASMR. You guys want me to be honest with you or uh, tell you the truth? It's kind of weird. It looks really pretty, but the flakes kind of just stick at the top of my roof. And I don't really taste the, the tomato sauce of the pizza. Maybe the original creators of this glitter pizza also ran into the same problem. And that's why they fused it in with the cheese. Because like, look, guys, if I just turn this upside down, the amount of shit that's going to fall off is going to stress me out. I just bit my tongue. Uh, look. That's kind of oh. I would rate it like an, a nice 6 out of 10. Maybe a 5.7 actually. Let me go in for another bite, guys. Check this out. Rainbow pizza. Oh my god. When I talk, the glitter flies off. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, uh, all over everywhere. A positive is uh, you get a rainbow tongue after. Ah. Alright, let's move on to my pizza um, to save you guys some time. Let's hit you guys with a nice little time lapse. Enjoy the music, kick back, go take a piss, go take a little dookie if you need to. Here.
and we are back with all of our ingredients that took way longer than I expected by the way thank god there was a time lapse but I got my rainbow in front of me I got my tomatoes my green peppers my orange peppers and this is the question I need to ask everyone I need everyone to participate in this in the comment section down below do you think Pineapple belongs on pizza. Comment down below yes if you think pineapple is good on pizza. Comment no if you think pineapple is shitty on pizza. As you can see for the blue and purple, I just put some cheese, mozzarella pizza cheese, and then food coloring inside. Just mix it up with a fork and you're good to go. And as I said at the start of the video, this is a rainbow pizza you can make at home. These aren't any like funky freaking ingredients. So we're gonna start with the red as we did with the glitter. Some more tomatoes. And then we gotta move on to the orange. So right here, grab a bunch of the orange pepper, put that around. This one I can already tell it's a little bit more messy, you know? Yo, if you're on a diet, bro, this is a nice alternative to getting pepperoni and stuff get some of this oh my god I made so much green I think yellow goes first okay we got the pineapple right here oh my god I made too much that's enough yellow we don't need that much I'm gonna push everything to the edge so I can get more room here here comes the blue cheese oh yes that looks freaking vibrant as hell. I should have just made all cheese different colors. Why did I have to get tomato and everything? And then finally the purple right in the middle. And there you go, just like that, you got a rainbow pizza that you can actually eat. Oh my god, that actually looks sick. What the hell? This is pretty naughty. And I'm definitely excited to try this one rather than the other one because this one I can actually eat everything on top. Oh. Much better. Whoever said I'm not on a diet? Hmm? What did I rate the other one? I rate this pizza legit an 8 out of 10. What I would do differently, maybe take it easy on the toppings if I'm actually trying to be serious. But for the purpose of YouTube, I have to go hard for it to look pretty. I'm going for another slice, bro. That shit's delicious. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Pineapple. Oh. Um. Thank you guys so much for watching Parodians. I need to go clean my fingers right here. They're all stained with that food coloring. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat, guys. I post on there literally every single day. You will get sick of seeing my face. But until next time, I will see you guys very soon. Have an amazing weekend. I love you guys. Hey!